So one day, when I was doing some important research, I had one of my greatest ideas ever. What if I tried to learn the entire French language in just one week? So this week, I'm gonna attempt to learn French. I wanna get as fluent as possible in these seven days and just see how much I can learn while locked in my room. Now, of course, I do know Spanish. I was in Barcelona for a few months, but I know no French whatsoever. I know bonjour and merci, and that's about it. So we're just gonna see how much I can learn in these seven days. So I don't really have like a definite plan on what I'm doing here, but I'm going to start by going on to Duolingo because I just need to learn the basics of the language right now. I want to learn French. 15 million people. We're going to make it 15 million point one. <laughs> oh, guys, they are underestimating us big time. Are you kidding me? 20 minutes a day. We're talking 20 hours a day. But, you know, we're, we gotta do intense. All right, so we're officially in on Duolingo. The first thing that it's asking is, which of these is the boy? And since they do have icons, it's, it's actually pretty obvious, so. Le garçon, le homme. I'll probably say these completely wrong, too. Okay, so this looks pretty basic. I think I'm just gonna try to grind this out for an hour, see where I get to. Hopefully I can just pick up some of the basics while I'm doing this. According to my extensive knowledge so far, that means a woman and a boy. Okay guys, so it's 10.30 at night at the end of day one, and I've put in probably around three hours of studying French so far. I'm getting there. I kind of understand the very, very, very basics of the language, and I'm sure the next six days just refreshing constantly and learning new things will get me more. But I think if I put in at least three hours a day, from here on out, I can get pretty far. So I'll see you tomorrow for day two. So it's the morning of day two now. I have a ton of work to do today. I think the goal for today is get through the entire first level of Duolingo. I did a bit less than half yesterday. So if I can really push it today and get through that first level, I think I'm in a good place. At the end of the day, I'm gonna call my friend who is almost fluent in French and just kind of talk about some strategies I can use to help myself learn French better. Let's get started. So on Duolingo, I am dominating this league. This is like people I'm competing against. 1000 XP from yesterday. People aren't even close. So I've been studying French the last three hours or so, which makes it about six or seven for the last two days. My mind is fixed in French. I'm gonna give my friend a call, see if he has any tips that he can give me to help me learn more. Plus, see if I can kind of hold a conversation after two days. Bonjour. Bonjour, comment ça va? Oh, I knew that. I understood that. Trace bien. Très bien. Très bien. Très bien. very American. A good word to practice. Un hamburger. Un hamburger. Okay, the thing I think I really need to work on is my accent. Yeah, you sound pretty American. That's the problem, because I haven't been speaking it. I've just been, like, reading it and, like, writing it. And I, I feel like I need a way to speak it somehow. Okay, do you know what I'm saying here? This is, like, the peak of what I can say, pretty much. <laughs> Mon ferre, uh, ab abete in Virginia. Uh, yeah, you don't have for two days. If you had any like way I could learn it, like what would be the best way? I would just practice spelling and writing sentences. So just okay. repetition over and over. Yeah, because I mean, spelling's a big thing, I think. Okay, so I'll call you back on Sunday. We'll try to have a full French conversation with all I've learned. Okay, good. <laughs> all right, all bye. Dites-moi en français. Day number three, we are starting off super late today because I had to publish a video. That took most of the morning, but now it's late afternoon and we are gonna grind through some French as one does. So the last two days, I feel like I've gotten a good gist of the basics here. 
I think today, since I'm starting so late, I just want to really hone in what I've already learned and not really push and try to learn too much new stuff. I'm going to try to at least get two hours in today and yeah, hope for the best. And then going into day four, we'll be halfway through and I want to really, really take off tomorrow. But today, just a review day, kind of an excuse, but <laughs> okay, I'm going to grind on Duolingo. Fam. 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 Looking back, it's actually so crazy how far I've come in just three days. Like, I literally knew no French three days ago, and now I can string together some basic sentences. Like, it's come together so fast. I can't wait to see where I am in double the amount of time. Alright, so it is day four four now and it is time to really pick up the pace yesterday was not a great day right here you can see kind of my graph of the days and wednesday i took a big hit but thursday we're gonna come back in a big way so i'm gonna lock in get a few hours of grinding in and i think at the end of today i'm gonna take like a test and see how much i've learned Let me just say, I have completely turned it around today. This has been the day I've most worked on French this entire week so far. I'm gonna take a beginner's test and see how much I've learned in the last four days. How much French did I know before starting Duolingo? Absolutely zero. My name is Lucy, and you? The girl is big and her name is Michelle, so that would be La because it's feminine Spanish coming in here. Hello. I would like two glasses of orange juice, a cup of tea, and two cups of cafe with milk. That was a straight up guess. I had no idea. Okay guys, that wraps it up for this quiz. It looks like I passed, but I think that's probably gonna wrap it up for me today. Okay guys, so it is the start of day number five. We're really getting into it today, but I thought I'd switch things up at the beginning of this day and bring in this guy. Right What's here. up guys? <laughs> this is my twin brother if you don't know. We both knew absolutely no French. I know like croissant, beignet, crepe, chocolate. <laughs> it's a very limited sect. I gotta know what to order when I'm in France. So we were at the same level five days ago and I'm just gonna let him take the test and see how much of what I know right now, he knows. Uh, 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 uh. Un? No. What? So you need to translate okay. this. I know I is J. Okay, then I'll we'll start with J. Okay. Uh, three. No! I'm doing well. BN, number one. Nice. Spanish coming yeah. into play. What? I heard a B as the first letter. <laughs> Alex okay. goes to... Oh, I can think about it as like roulette. <laughs> Casino? <laughs> 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 this is getting way too hard. <laughs> like, how am I supposed to know this? <laughs> how can you how tell? I where all of these are. Give it up for Jacob. He did his best. Now I'm going to keep grinding. I got two days left, and I'm going to take that final test. Day six now. Rock in the new flow to really help me learn this language. Well, I've got to the point where I can pretty much speak some basic sentences. So I pretty much have the literacy of about a four or five year old. But today I'm just going to do what I've been doing, grind through some more, see how far I can get. And then tomorrow's the big test. See how much I've learned in seven days. My mind is literally going numb from French, but it's work. Like I can say these basic sentences. Let me give you an example really fast of what I'm working on right now. Okay, so this one right here, it's pretty simple. So nos is going to be we, and then voyageons is in the we form of voyager, which is our traveling. And then finally, avec means with and Marie. Woo. So I ended up putting in a 
couple hours of work again. My mind is just absolutely frayed. I mean, guys, I've really been grinding for this video, so make sure to leave a like, leave a comment if I should do another language, and of course, subscribe if you want to see great content like this. I'm going to be back four day seven tomorrow to put our French to the test and see how much we were able to learn. Okay, so it is officially the last day of French learning. And to wrap it all up, I'm gonna give my friend Daniel a call who I called earlier in the week. And he has a few questions for me to kind of test my proficiency of French. Bonjour. Oui, bonjour, comment ça va? C'est va bien. I haven't had much practice talking. I, I can read it really well. Good. Okay. <laughs> are you asking why are you learning French? Oui, oui. Oh, oui, oui. Pourquoi le vidéo? As-tu fait quelque chose de spécial pour la fête des mères? Wow, that was complicated. <laughs> okay, so you're asking, did you do something special for Mother's Day? Oui, très bien. Ah, uh, nous mangeons ou steak? Oui, oui, oui. Quelle est ta chose préférée? I heard you too. That's all I heard. What is your favorite thing about your YouTube channel? Oh my gosh, that's so complicated. I don't even know how to answer that. Even in Spanish. Is ta mère contente aujourd'hui? Is your mom happy with you today? Oui, très bien. Oh, let's go. How do you think I did? I think I asked you a little, maybe two advanced questions. Daniel, merci, au revoir. So overall, I feel like I really learned a lot of French in that week. It was tough to really, really become fluent, but I put in so much time. You can't really tell in the video, and I really think it paid off at the end. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. It's embarrassing. I'm not going on YouTube. I look like an idiot.